Did you ever try to toss two coins at once? What is the chance to get both tails or both heads? Obviously one half. The chance to have the same results is even smaller if you throw two dice. And very small if the dice have many faces. According to quantum physics, a single photon is similar to a dice before it's thrown. It is fundamentally probabilistic. Before detection, a photon has no definite position or momentum or polarization. And still, photon pairs can show perfect correlations as if two dice showed the same numbers every time they were thrown together. This effect has to do with entanglement and has important applications in metrology, imaging and information transmission. In our project BRISC2, funded by the European Commission within the seventh framework program, we are trying to make light behave the same way as these dice. We want light to show photon number correlations, or in other words, quantum entanglement. And we want to use these features for interesting applications. In particular, we are looking at the state of light called bright squeezed vacuum. To generate this state of light, a strong laser beam is sent into a crystal or fiber with special properties. Some photons of the laser beam are split in two. As a result, two beams emerge that are exact copies of each other. The resulting twin beams come as pulses of bright light. They have perfect photon number correlations, hence the fluctuations of a photon number difference are suppressed and the resulting photon number distribution is squeezed. Although each of the twin beams has a random number of photons from zero to millions, the number of photons in a single pulse is exactly equal to the number of photons in its twin. It is as if two polyhedron dice with a million faces were thrown at once and showed the same faces each time. To further study and exploit this effect, an international team collaborates within the project BRISC2. Its coordinator is the Max Planck Institute of the Science of Light in Germany with Dr. Maria Chekova as representative. The focus of the project BRISC2 is at applying bright squeezed vacuum to various fields where classical methods reach their limits. With our light beams, we will be able to detect very weak objects upon a noisy background. We also aim at imaging very small objects, for instance molecules with increased sensitivity. We will try to use twin beams for secure information transmission. We plan to pass their unique properties to material objects such as tiny mechanical systems. And, who knows, maybe this way the quantum computer dream will come true. We are looking for collaborations. If you like what we are doing today, you can be part of what we will be doing tomorrow. Just contact us on www.brisk2.eu.